safeguarding the health of the youth is top of the mind of the Federal Competition and Consumer Protection Commission, FCCPC, as they inaugurate the Don't Burn Their Future campaign. One of the motivations for the campaign is the revelation that 4.5 million Nigerians of 15 years and above are tobacco users. Youth using multiple tobacco products are at a higher risk of developing nicotine dependence, potentially leading to continued tobacco use into adulthood. Understanding the risks associated with youth tobacco use is crucial for public health initiatives and educational campaigns. It emphasizes the need for preventive measures to discourage early initiation into smoking. The campaign has the support of the National Tobacco Control Community. Working closely with the FCCPC, they believe that this campaign simplifies their work. Part of the launch of this advocacy campaign, which would increase public sensitization on the dangers of tobacco use, including exposure, exposure to school the dangers of youth exposure to tobacco cannot be overemphasized. However, there's the need for a balance in perspectives. The immediate past CEO of FCCPC, Mr. Babatunde Rukera, explains the difficult situation which products like tobacco place regulators. Regulator doesn't take sides. Recognize the fact that tobacco consumers our constituents of the FCCPC and the FCCPC owes them an obligation of protection and access to those products that they so desire. But as a regulator also, FCCPC has a responsibility from a national priority standpoint, which Nigeria has established and demonstrated very clearly by signing on to treaties and taking certain steps and establishing institutions and mechanisms to prevent smoking initiation amongst young people and reduce consumption amongst older people. The FCCPC sets the campaign as the initial part of a series of lectures, hangouts and meetings to push for a tobacco-free future, especially among the youths.